Hello Nuggets, it's your favorite TT from Divine Me 1111 Spiritual Guidance. We're going to get into Pisces energy. Yes, I decided to show my face for Pisces reading because I love us. Okay, now, thank you all so much for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. It means a lot. It helps the message get out to other people. So I appreciate you doing that. Also, if you need to book a personal, the information is in the description box. I hate sounding like a record player, but that's the only way I can get it all out. Um, yes, and yeah, if you need to book a personal, all the stuff is down in the description box. There's also links to Facebook, IG, and Twitter. Okay, that's out of the way. I have three channel songs for Pisces today. I have um, two of them are by the Gap Band. It's outstanding, and you dropped the bomb on me. And then the um, the last song I got was um, Saturday by um, Sir Elton John. So take that how it applies. Give me one second. All right, I'm sorry. I was feeling uncomfortable. I had to fix some stuff. Anywho. All right, let's get a TT's Music Oracle, okay? Ooh, here y'all go. All right, I um, didn't want it to be a whole stack, but it's it's not really a whole stack, It's but it's quite a few. So we're gonna take them. Um, I like by, I like it by Switch. This is the one by Switch. I'm hearing the one by um uh hearing i like the way instead of i like it i'm hearing i like the way by high five but this is i like it by switch and every time i i hear this i or see this card i have to stop and think what is this and how it, how does it go but it was one of the songs so anywho Oh, God's Plan by Lonnie. Earth Angel New Edition. One in a Million, Aaliyah. Booed Up, Ella May. Um, it Ain't Over Till It's Over by Lenny Kravitz. And Baby, I'm a Star by the Purple One, Prince underneath oh okay under here we have warning by incubus and oh my gosh that is like my other than drive that is my favorite song that incubus does and um it's more so like a wake-up call it's like a um the lyrics are bat your eyes girl be otherworldly count your blessings seduce a stranger What's so wrong with being happy? Kudos to those who see their sickness. Um, uh, let's see which one. Those left standing will make millions writing books on the way things should have been. She, the chorus, there it is. I was trying to get to the chorus. Um, she woke in the morning she woke in the morning she knew that her life had passed her by she called out a warning don't ever let life pass you by seize the moment do what you have to do do what you're being called to do pisces to be completely in your bliss okay um you're gonna make mistakes make them uh not everybody's gonna be on board with with, with what you do it's okay um you're going to fumble god let you fall yet not really you ain't really fail because God's always got you. So it's coming into the understanding of that learning and being in the energy of, I'm okay. No matter what I decide to do, no matter what steps I decide to take or don't take, 
wherever I decide to be and not be, you're okay. I like that. That's fantastic. Um, you know, realizing also that there's no one like you and it's okay. There's no one like, you know, doing this or, you know, there's there could be 50 million and one people, one in a million. Nobody like you. Embrace that. Discover that. Um, don't be afraid of it. Okay? Just flow. Flow. If you got to start over, start over. But flow. Okay, Pisces? Just, you know, let God shift. Because there's, no, there's nothing else that is more constant than change. So just, you know, move with it, grow with it, expand it, feel it out, all right? <clears throat> I want to dance for some reason. All right, we have the zebra. The zebra is, I'm hearing, um, this girl is on fire. Girl on fire by um, Miss Alicia Keys. You are. It's and it's not just about the you know the female. It's about the energy. You are moving, being, and doing, or being called to move, be, and do, and just groove. Okay, groove. Um, for some, it's the energy of standing out amongst a crowd of people that are just like you-ish, but still knowing that there is no one else like you, okay? Take it how it applies, Pisces. Don't be scared. It's the rabbit. Don't be scared. Even if, you know... Even if it looks scary, do it. Do it afraid. Just take a just take a leap of faith. Okay, take that leap of faith. All right. Let's see what's this. It's quite a few. It's all right. We'll take them. They're telling a story to me right now. We have the black egg, which is speak up, open up that throat chakra. Throat chakra. I'm gonna be able to talk. It's okay. Just keep going, you know, even if, you know, you mess up, it's okay. Keep talking, keep speaking, keep saying the truth. As long as it's truth, as long as you are speaking from a pure place, do it. You got to. You're being called to do this. You're being called to say words. Grounded words not you know words that are you know from a primal place but from a grounded a grounded taking a leap place you're gonna mess up but it's not about the mess up it's about the keeping going and evolving and allowing yourself to expand and change your mind and you know be a free thinker okay um, you're gonna be called on and for some of you this is you know some possibly some kind of legal situation possibly some kind of um, innovative place maybe you could be doing something different but it is very much needed at this time okay Pisces and take it how it applies it could be what I'm doing right now like being on a platform I ain't never think I was gonna be doing no stuff like this but 
it is what it is however it shows up for you um, if you are being called to um, you know lead a project or you're starting a new job whatever it is Pisces um, this can also even be um, a relationship that's the swan and that's um, water energy but it's not just about you making it look easy anymore it's about you expressing and you know knowing that you're going to you know you're still growing and you're going to make the mistakes so I am preaching to myself hopefully this resonates to somebody else cuz yeah that's what's coming through I just looked over and saw um, Earth Angel by New Edition so um, someone could be seeing you as such Pisces um, you could be very much soothing to somebody in this time of whatever it is that they could possibly be going through or you are very much in need of you know somebody to kind of take the pressure off now I'm hearing who um, wait a minute who can I run to by escape so maybe you're wanting to just you know you maybe you need this you just need a a place or a sense or a piece of peace and relief and um, there's you know that vulnerable inside part of you that is just you know terrified but you're right now coming into um, being able to speak that from a from a, a really pure place oh my gosh I'm not crying with y'all today I'm not nope. no 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 not in my house <laughs> What is, who is that, um, Dikembe Matombo? Oh my gosh, I'm not fooling with y'all today. Go ahead and say words. Whatever it is that you're speaking, even if this is you needing to speak life over yourself to get you, you know, using affirmations, whatever it is that you need to be doing for you right now, Pisces. But, um, just know that there's nothing that that you can't do for one and two either this is you about yourself or how someone sees you outstanding by the gap band i'm sitting here looking at my notes all right so hey how it let it be how it be pisces that's all i can say i'm not taking all 12 of those cards no sir no ma'am ah, the number 12 that is us you know 12th house that energy of you know believing the impossible being in the 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 higher realms of consciousness whereas um uh, aquarius is more so the higher realm of thinking pisces is that higher realm of consciousness so that's where you are you're himself you're yourself embodying within you that alignment that y'all see my I ain't coloring that stuff no more I might try to do a purple I don't know anywho but um, yeah just you know being who you are and grounded in that this could also be um, uh, the way that you are seeing someone them being grounded in themselves being um, enlightened this could be someone who's you know um, observing I'm gonna say observing intense this is an, an intense observation I'm seeing okay the bright mother um, this is um, the energy of the Empress 
the um i'm hearing the mature woman and i'm not sure what deck that's from but that's from another uh another um oracle deck and it's it's called uh the mature woman you going from um having you know inspiration and you know dreams and just right now just embodying that creating everything it is that you wish to see focusing on the tasks at hand I'm seeing and just kind of it's 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 she kind of looks a little smug I'm not gonna lie I'm not gonna lie she's looking at you know having the world in her hands and just not really paying attention to um, what's really you know going on but very much focused on what she's able to create I like that I like that. So, set, card number 17 is himself, which is that energy of uh, the divine masculine, you can say, himself. And then card number 16, basically herself. So, emperor, empress energy. I like that. That's neat. That's neat, Pisces. That's what is that's are you manifesting? That's cool. You don't have to manifest too far because your um your counterpart is manifesting as well. So what you want wants you. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. Yesterday I did the all of the fixed signs. This card came out each time in the third position, each time in each reading. Please go check those out. There might be a message in there for you, Pisces. And you. Or, you know, book a personal, whatever. But, yeah, healing. This is, oh, this is so nice. We got the, the the swan, you guys reflecting each other, mirroring each other, or this could be you within yourself, just present. Oh, confirmation. Having manifested this, didn't I say manifesting the fairy godmother with all her little creatures that are around her? you know the the balance there there's one of flesh I'm gonna show y'all these cards that was underneath these these two underneath uh, bottom cards too because they match as well so these to me here match okay this is divine orchestration okay divine orchestration either this was an energy that was trying to keep you apart or a divine energy that was trying to keep you together or bring you together but what i'm looking at is it, it was trying to it was doing its best to try to keep you apart but it, it can't do it anymore you see how topsy turvis and the fire ants whatever this energy was that was trying to keep you and your your counterpart or keep you from the um whatever you're trying to manifest whatever your dream was whatever this foolishness was not anymore not anymore it can last no longer this is you're you're it's beyond you now you you did what you had to do you moved the mountain that you had to move for yourself in the physical however you resonate with that and now there's this this is how it completes 
in this cycle. I am so just, this is magnificent. So, wait, yeah. This is how it looks down on the table. Himself, the masculine energy, um, the uh, emperor energy, the bright mother, feminine energy, singer of healing. I like it. Go ahead on Pisces. Y'all good. I'm, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Then I look over and I see Baby I'm a Star by Prince. And anybody who knows me knows that that is my fault. Love him. So it's the star speaks of healing. Um, so, and we did, we just, we just ended that. So we're now going into the age of Aquarius. Yes. Um, how that specifically works because we were in the age of Pisces, how that specifically works. I'm not 100% sure, but we're growing and learning. And as I grow and learn, we'll, we'll, we'll figure those things out. But, um, to my understanding, we are now, um, in the age of Aquarius where we've left behind that, um, energy that was too clouded and too, um, uh, heavy and that, um, energy that was not in, in balance. It was too much of a give energy whereas now we are in the energy of an allow space okay ace of earth this is the new beginning this is a new beginning okay um god just showing up and saying hey okay here it here it is here it is you asked for it 22 22 right there Pisces, you asked for it, I'm going to give it to you. Okay, so three came out. What is that? The, oh my gosh. Okay. Ace is a monk. So, we have the ten of fire, the ten of wands. This is burden, you know, having to juggle and do very various things all at one time. And actually, you know, doing it okay all the way down to you know what i'm done i'm done i'm good i've done this i'm one we just gonna do one now and we're gonna follow that and we're gonna go with it allow it it's a lot of passion it's a lot of passion it's a lot of um getting over obstacles and Again, Pisces doing it even though you may be afraid to do so, but taking the leap and saying words, speaking out, moving forward at least, listening to, you know, some kind of, um, this could be an apology, but some kind of message, getting, you know, a little um message of um <clears throat> excuse me emotions being expressed okay that's the messenger of water my squirrels oh y'all look at it yay okay so traditional tarot this is the lover's card but in this card it's the love card and it's about oneness and um, a singular understanding of love with yourself, love with God, and love with another. This is taming all of that angst and, you know, being able to be at peace. This also reminds me of Aslan. So this is divine peace traditional tarot it's the lovers so it's you a significant other or you know 
wherever you're supposed to be, place, person, have what have you. You that and then divine. Okay, so yay. Good job, Pisces. Good job. Um, this could be a Gemini, because that's a Gemini card, the lovers is Gemini card, or uh, Leo, because see, there's that, the fire sign up there, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay, what's underneath? Oh my gosh, this is such a beautiful message, Pisces. Oh, this is after having, you know, been in the place and space of gaining your own understanding of yourself, okay? Um, making the decisions to do what needs to be done. This could also be, um, again, Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. Um, but I'm going to leave that there. That was a really cool message, Pisces. I hope you were able to get something out of that. And um, if you need to book a personal, the information is down in the description box. So, um, yeah, we're going to leave it at that. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, double emphasis on Gemini, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Not so much Earth signs showing up, but it could be. I'm just talking about the energies, okay? All right, I love you. I love you from my soul, and I send you all blessings and light. Take care.